All right, people, Catfish Dave here. Uh, uh, I'm in break mode, but uh, I'm just doing a little update here. But my old boat, y'all familiar with that? Well, I was having trailer issues, and it's been down a while. And, uh, well, I finally found somebody that will do it. I got to take the boat to them for a week, uh, and I should have a trailer in six weeks. Well, you know, I'm not waiting uh, till March. Uh, to start fishing so i went and did a thing and this is the thing right here um this is what i'm gonna be fishing out of uh v bottom 16.5 aluma weld uh and it reason i like it it's a tiller no console but as you can see we've just got a wide open floor back there uh i'm in the process of uh Installing a depth finder, some new batteries and chargers. So I got a lot of tools and stuff. It's 50 just like I had, only tiller model. It's already got a bunch of rod holders on it. These are removable, or you can slide them where you want to. And uh, it's even got a live well uh, in here. It's where I can keep certain types of live bait pretty well you know bluegills crappies white bass or whatever i catch uh it's already got a 24 volt 70 pound thrust power drive with the uh, spot lock i pilot all that for dragon baits spot lock and whatever you need to do so uh, i got the boat kind of tore apart uh hadn't done no update in a while uh it's got a good trailer under it and this boat uh, I knew the guy that had it. This thing has uh, won many a catfish tournament out of this little boat. So it's a seaworthy boat. It's easy to work on. Uh, if you got to pull anything up, all these panels, the floor, everything's got screws. You can actually pull the boat apart. What I didn't like about my boat is you couldn't do nothing unless you knew a, a welder and a fabricator, you know? So... Uh, this is it, y'all. Uh, this is a little Catfish Dave update. This is uh, so y'all can see what's going on here. But I'm sh probably going to be on the water next week because I've got to decide where I'm going to be putting my cameras and all that kind of stuff and mounting them. But uh, I will get back to fishing real soon, and I'm just giving y'all a little update on what's going on here.